Hi guys, on this series we are going to build a Netflix layout clone. You can see here the demo. We are going to use collection views and uh, composition layouts. You can see on the bottom we have also a tab bar controller. I think it's a um, good introduction to composition layout and uh, collection views in general. So let's start building it. A starting project I have already here the image we are going to use. You can find this in source code. And um, I use this image as a reference. You can see uh, how the layout will look like. We have a navigation on the bottom. So let's start with that to main that storyboard. Select this and tab bar controller. Okay. Now delete this. and add four, one for each item, uh, navigation controllers. So, navigation controller, here, put it on this side. And connect view controller. Add more tree like this one we can copy command C select and command C to copy and put it on the button. Another one and the last one. Now connect the other three, view controller, view controller, and view controller as well as type, view controller. Now we need to add the root view controllers. To do that, let's put here some view controllers. View controller put here for this one. And control and root view controller. Now, copy. Paste here. It's on top, okay here for this one copy this and put it here and I copy now this one oh, no let's go to the right uh, left side and copy here okay copy and paste and put it here that's fine now let's connect control and the root view controller, press control again and root view controller, and same thing for this one. Okay. Now edit these options. So select the first one, this, and uh, the type. No, not here, the image. The image is home kit. This one. And the title home. The image as well here as home kit. 
now you can edit this this we just need to change the type from custom to search let's do it now you have to go here and select search okay the next one is uh, done holds i think so go here and change for done holds exactly now the last one is more type as more let's run it and see how it looks now build succeed and you can see here the icons now we need to change this color from blue to a light gray we are in dark mode but let's see how it looks in light mode okay dark mode again we are going to work mostly in dark mode so to change the color select this and change here the color so go to the right side and change this color to gray this one light gray let's see how it looks now run it it looks fine now we are going to add the image here on the top so let's first close this to keep, keep it more organized okay almost and this one we can leave open seems fine now let's go to view controller and and the image first connect this class to this one to the view controller view controller here and now we can go to the view controller class now I'm going to create a method to place the image and also to configure the collection view so remove this comment now and uh, call here the method set up view and create the method private func set up view Okay, the comment do not forget to configure collection view and uh, here call the method to set the image. Let's call it set navigation bar image and uh, create this method. Copy here and create the method private funk paste and okay now to place the image we need to create an y image and uh, pass as argument the name of the image name let's go to assets to make sure i call the right name and it's called log navbar copy and place it here now create the image view image view and pass the y image I name it logo uh, I mean so yeah, exactly like this the content mode Uh, aspect fit and now 
associate this image view with the navigation bar through navigation bar item dot title view okay let's run it and see okay you can see it's there now let's add the the titles to the other screen so let's go here and select this and change here the title this one is like this this one downwards if i'm not wrong downwards and more now run it see image now if you click here okay you can see it changing screens but we will only work on this one okay. on the movie feed that we are going to build we are going to use a collection view and the composition layout I'm going to show you the image now that um, I use as base is this one the composition layout as sections, uh, groups, and items. Each of these rows is a, a section. So you saw the, the top is a se section with groups, and each group has one item. But I will show you in code. Let's add first the collection view. Put it here. This is the home. Um, View controller and add constraint. It's zero, zero, all sides. This one's zero, and button as well zero. Can now connect this collection view to the Swift class. Let's do that now. So let's go to view controller option to open both uh, side by side. Okay, now. Press Ctrl and drag the collection view to here to the top and call it collection view. Press connect and we can close the storyboard. Before starting um, creating the sections and the, the groups on this video, I want to create the structure of the project. So let's uh, place this swift classes in the in folders to keep it more organized create here new uh, not new file new 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 group from selection exactly and this one is view and uh, controllers use I will keep the storyboard and uh, everything that is related with um, layouts control is to connect the models and uh, the views and uh, the delegates the its own package delegates put the app delegate inside as well the storyboard the launch storyboard here and put the assets inside the resources resources okay like this and another one for the models where I will keep uh, all the data classes group models is not inside the delegate but outside here uh, extensions you can um, use different organization but for this project because it's just a demo I I found this way to um, to keep it organized group again and um, data manager to supply the data to the view controllers okay
uh, it's working in the same way. I will end the video here, but on the next one uh, I'm going to build the first section, the one with the uh, highlights on top and uh, don't forget to subscribe, to don't miss it. So see you then.